All right, hello. We got a question from James H. So, baseball team plays in a stadium that holds 58,000 spectators. Ticket price at $9. The average attendance goes to 23,000. When the price dropped to $7, the average attendance rose to 29,000. Assume that attendance is linearly related to ticket price. Okay, linearly related. That means we should probably use the equation of a line. I like to use this one, the point slope formula. So we get two points. Ticket price is nine, average attendance is 23,000. So let's use nine, 23,000. When it dropped to $7, it rose to 29,000. The attendance did. So let's use the uh, formula for the slope. So 29,000 minus 23,000 is 6,000. Seven minus nine is negative two. Our slope is negative 3,000. Okay, so let's use this formula. I'm gonna pick this point, because why not? 23,000, slope is negative 3,000, x minus nine. Okay, let's sim simplify this out. negative 3,000 X plus 27,000 Y equals negative 3,000 X plus 50,000. Let's make that a little bit better, should we? Okay. Okay. So now, what do we know about revenue because the question is what ticket price would maximize revenue well your revenue would come from your ticket price times the number of people who bought tickets yeah so nine times twenty three thousand well notice that's just x times y so our equation for revenue is x times y so it wants us to maximize revenue so we want to take the derivative of it and set it equal to zero but first, let's try and make it so that there's just one variable. Let's make it so that the revenue is just a function of x. Well, we know that y equals this. So instead of y, I'm going to do x times our equation up there, like so. I'll distribute the x. So we get negative 3,000x squared plus 50,000x. Okay, and it wants us to maximize revenue, so we should take the derivative of this with respect to x. So power rule, 2 times our constant, so that's negative 6,000. And our exponent goes down to 1. And derivative of this is just 50,000. And we want to set this equal to 0 to maximize it. Subtract 50,000, so we get negative 6,000x equals negative 50,000. Divide by negative 6,000. Yes, I know my handwriting is atrocious. Just uh, bear with me for a second. So negatives cancel. 50,000 divided by 6,000. This will simplify to 50 over 6, or 25 over 3, or $8.33. This is the ticket price, the X value, that would maximize the revenue. Okay, that's it.